Hey guys, so today I have got the Witch Casket box for August to show you. Now if you've not seen me open this before, it is an English box and it's £27 a month. Um, they do post it worldwide but obviously it's all different prices to different countries so you would have to check for your country. I have heard it works out about $40 to America so that's one of them that I know but I'm not sure about everywhere else. Um, but we are just going to get straight into it. So the theme this month is courage and everything is like this red and gold very kind of regal looking theme this month um so this is the new little booklets that they're doing that tells you about all the items in the box in more detail so there is that then next on the top we've got this little envelope that's got a really cute little wax seal on it and this says courage postcard collection so I'm going to open this, try not to ruin it and see what these are. Okay, so these kind of like little prints, they do have a like a postcard back to them, um, but they are just sort of like prints. So this one says Fearless Witch. This one says Impossible Things Take Courage and a Little Magic. Just courage on a little like potion bottle and bravery is a hidden treasure we all hold so that is those like I said kind of like prints really them four then we have a little sticker like a little cauldron it's very cute I like when they do these ones that don't say witch casket on them just so you can kind of stick it anywhere and it's not like a promo thing it's just like a little spooky thing so that's pretty cute then we have our spell kit for the month and this one is courage ritual kit contains everything you need to leave your fears behind so let's see what this has in here my camera is already dying so hopefully i have another battery otherwise this is going to be very annoying <laughs> okay so in here we have the little instructions which I will hold up in case anyone wants to pause and read that or write them down. We then have these two little cards which on the back say I rid myself of the following fears with some lines. We have a little tea light candle, just a normal one. And we have some herbs, which is apparently chamomile or chamomile. So that is the little courage spell for the month. Next, we have our pin. You pretty much always get a pin every month. And this one says fearless witch with like a sword through a banner. And camera's not really wanting to focus today, but hopefully you can see what that looks like so there is that then we have some rue which i'm assuming is a herb it says it's for mental strength healing health and protection i'm not going to open it just because i don't actually use these i usually end up selling them or giving them away so um there's no point in me opening it but there is that we have some morning sunshine tea which says it's for confidence positive energy and joy doesn't say what's in it or what flavours in it or anything but there's a little well quite a big pouch of that then we have this which is I'm gonna assume a tea like strainer kind of thing it's actually quite a posh one it's got a little crystal on it um the card says red jasper tea infuser Turn tea into a witch's brew with this magical red jasper tea infuser. Red jasper is a stone of courage, stamina and vitality. So we've got this golden little tea strainer down here with this stone on the end, which is very pretty. Hopefully you can't hear too much of what's going on outside. I've got the window open and it sounds really loud here, but hopefully that's not annoying so that is that then next we have a little bag let's see what this is so this is like a little velvety bag with a label on which says 
Courage Crystal set. Now I've not opened this yet so I'm not sure what is in it but it is quite a heavy little bag. Um, okay so in here we've got four stones. So we've got this really big chunk. I'm not actually sure what these are. It doesn't say but I'm sure in the little booklet it will say so I'll have a look in a minute. But there is this one. This one. this one that one's a pretty one it's kind of like blues and sort of purpley looking white gray and this one again a very interesting spotty kind of one so let's have a look in this little booklet and see if it tells us what they actually are because i'm not great on um crystals okay so we've got tiger iron chinese bloodstone red jasper and i'm gonna absolutely butcher this but sardonyx maybe um so it is these four here i don't know which one is which I'm not gonna lie i'm gonna assume that this is maybe the jasper just because of the red jasper on the tea strainer it looks the same um but with the other three i'm not too sure which one is which so there is those then we have this which i'm gonna assume is a wax melt purely because it smells absolutely amazing now i don't know what this is but it doesn't smell like a normal candle -y house smell it actually really smells of perfume and if they did a perfume of this, I would definitely buy it. It smells really, really nice. Um, again, maybe the book says, actually, let's have a really quick look in the book, see if it says what scent it's supposed to be, because it smells so good. Um, apparently, it's got sandalwood and amber in it. Who knows? But this doesn't smell like anything herby to me. This smells like really sweet perfume for some reason um oh it literally says sandalwood and amber on it um so it's by urban loon that's the company and it's like a little black pentagram wax melt very cute like i said it smells incredible i think i'll probably end up keeping this and maybe just leaving it out to see if the scent kind of like comes off it because it smells so good so there is that then we have this which is a little keyring again i think this is jasper they're really liking the jasper this time yep red jasper keyring a simple way to carry the energies of red jasper with you for courage empowerment empowerment and endurance so just a little kind of heart shaped one on a gold keyring and then the last item apart from the scroll is I would say the biggest item which is this really pretty wooden box so it's got like a pentacle pentagram whatever we want to argue that it is um like painted on the top or drawn on the top and then it's just like this like a little storage box very cute it is kind of tough to get into i'm not gonna lie it's kind of like because it's just dry um plain wood it's like a little stiff but very very cute though and then like i said the last thing we have is our scroll which i will quickly open and see what it says so this one says a courage confidence boosting tools in magic i'm not going to read it because it's really long i will just hold it up in case any of you want to pause and read see what it says hopefully it's actually focusing because i'm having to film earlier recently um and for some reason when I leave my curtains open nothing focuses I've got to make it really light I mean I've got to make it really dark in here and like put a filming light on I wish I could just kind of leave the curtains open that would be a lot easier but for some reason in the daytime nothing wants to focus so 
is our little scroll anyway. So I'm just going to do a quick little overview of everything we got again. So there was the um, four little postcards or prints, the Courage Ritual Kit spell, the Morning Sunshine Tea, the Rue, the little pin, the sticker, the little four crystal kit, the red jasper keyring, the little tea strainer with jasper on it, the pentagram wax melt, and the big wooden box. So all of these things with the scroll was August's box. So yeah, um, not a bad one. I kind of liked this one. I think it was pretty good. The red and gold, not necessarily my favourite colour scheme. I'm not big on like the Jasper and stuff. Um, and I really don't really like gold. I'm a more silver kind of person. But I really did like this box. So I'm definitely going to keep this box. Um, a lot of things I do put for sale on Depop. I'll put my Depop down below in case you want to check that out. But I think the box is going to be staying mine. So um, I hope you like this video. Anyway, if you did, please subscribe. I'll put all the info down below for Witch Casket in case you want to go and check them out. And I also have a giveaway that's still going on. If you've not already seen it, it's on until the 5th of September. So if you want to go and enter that, all you've got to do is uh, leave a comment on that video. So again, I will put the video down in the description in case you want to go and comment on that and maybe win some free stuff. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching and I will see you soon. Bye guys.